Hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome to another one of our daily video devos. Renee here. I am in the land of Israel. Today, I'm in the desert, and I am standing in front of one of the Dead Sea Caves. This cave is where some of the very famous Dead Sea Scrolls were found. Why is that important? Well, if you want to understand the ministry of Christ, you have to go back before the time of Christ, centuries before, there are 351 prophecies in the Hebrew Scriptures, what we call the Old Testament, about the coming Messiah that Jesus Christ fulfilled. Now, you might ask, how do we know those prophecies were really in the Hebrew Scriptures at the time of Christ? How do we know Christians didn't stick them back in the Bible? Well, we didn't know for thousands of years, for about 2,000 years, until beginning in 1947, about a thousand Dead Sea Scrolls were discovered here in caves in the desert south of Jerusalem. And we found that those Dead Sea Scrolls match almost exactly our modern Bibles, proving that the verses in the Hebrew Scriptures, the Old Testament, about the coming Messiah that Jesus fulfilled were in the Bible before Christ ever lived. In other words, now we know, thanks to the discoveries here, that they were actual prophecies. Prophecies like these verses from Isaiah chapter 53. It says, He was pierced for our transgressions. He was crushed for our iniquities. The punishment that brought us peace was upon Him. And by His wounds, we are healed. He was assigned a grave with the wicked, with the rich in his death. And though the Lord makes his life an offering for sin, he will see the light of life and be satisfied. By knowledge of him, my righteous servant will justify many. I mean, that sounds like an epistle written by the Apostle Paul, but it was in the Bible centuries before Christ. What that says to me, and what, what I hope is going to get you stoked today, is this. You and I, today, 2,000 years after Christ, were the object of a plan that God put into place centuries and centuries and centuries ago, centuries before Christ lived on earth. We were the object of a plan of redemption. That is how much God loves you. That's how much God wants to prepare an invitation for you to come into his presence. If God went to those lengths to have a relationship with you, make sure you spend time with God today because he is like your lover in the desert calling out to you, let's spend time together. Let's have a relationship together. I, I hope that makes your head spin and you're going to have a great day as you think about God's plan to have a relationship with you.